Hello everyone and welcome to my Groupama FDJ team review from the 2022 tour. Rupama FDJ came into the tour with the sole plan of delivering David Godu to the front and giving him a high GC position as possible. And I think that he achieved that and then some. I expected him to be sort of fifth to tenth, he got fourth. And that was in itself is a brilliant result, his best Grand Tour result of his career. But I want to talk about how FDJ rode as a whole for him. They saw in the Dauphiné that when he pushed it a bit too hard, he exploded and lost some big time. So they paced it. That is incredibly mature to allow the GC favourites to go up the road knowing that he is pacing his effort with his teammates and will get back on. That was most evident on the Granon stage where he topped the Granon, I think, a two and a half minutes, three minutes behind uh, Pogaccio and Vindigal. But by the bottom of the Granon, he'd caught them back up and still got to maybe three teammates. Incredibly mature ride from David Godu and the team. And they still finished second on a couple of stages with Madoas and fourth with Pino. Madoas himself finished 11th overall and Pino 15th. <coughs> in despite working so hard for David Godu. It's a fantastic tour for FDJ. Fourth is a great result. Yes, they didn't get the stage wins. But they have someone in the future that, given the right Giro route, I don't see him winning the Tour necessarily, but given the right Giro route, why not? Why not? 